Hi everyone and thanks for watching my online lesson on enlargement from a centre. So before you watch this video, you need to be comfortable first with just enlargement of shapes. So for example, this question here, if it said draw an enlargement of the triangle by scale factor 2 on the grid, you should already be able to do that. This is just going to take you through how we do it when they give you a centre. So this question, they have given me a centre and they've plotted it on for me. This is my centre here and I'm asked to enlarge this triangle by scale factor 2 from this centre. So what this centre tells me is not only is this shape going to get twice as big, but it's going to get twice as far away from my centre. So whatever this distance is here, it's going to be doubled to get to my new triangle. So the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to pick... You can pick any vertex on your shape, but it's usually easiest to go for the one that's closest to you. So I'm going to go for this one here, because that's closest to the centre. So to get from the centre to this vertex, you have to travel two squares to the right and one square up. Now, because this is scale factor 2, I've got to double these distances. So again, counting from the centre... This time, I'm going to go four squares right and two squares up. So that is where this corner, this vertex, will end up on my new shape. Now, once I've done one vertex, I can now tell where my triangle is going to end up. It's going to be up here. I've just got to draw this triangle enlarged by scale factor two, making sure this corner is placed there. I'm going to do that now. I'm going to go, well, this triangle goes two squares across, so I'm going to go four. It goes three up, so I'm going to go six up and then join my final points. Obviously, you need to do this a lot neater. I made a bit of a mess here. You need to do this with a ruler and definitely with a pencil and make sure it's really neat edges. But that's how we enlarge from a centre. Here's one more example and this time it's on a coordinate grid and the shape is a little bit more complicated. So this question is still scale factor 2 and the centre is 1, 1. So I first have to plot on the centre, they've not given me the centre on the grid. So 1, 1 is this coordinate here. Again I'm going to pick any vertex on my shape, I'm going to pick the one closest to the centre which is this one here. So to get from my centre to this vertex, it is one square to the right. So I'm going to double this because it's scale factor 2. So I'm going to go two squares to the right. And that is where my new corner will end up. So it's only really being shifted one square to the right. I could do it for other vertexes if I'm not sure how to draw my shape from that alone. But I'm going to draw it straight away. So this is going to go... Well, the bottom of the shape is only one square, so my new shape is going to be two squares. It goes three squares high, so that's going to become six squares high. At the top, it's two squares, that's going to become four. And then I'm going to join up my final edge. And there you go. Thank you for watching.